This is Charleston, South Carolina, and I'm here to interview Bill Murray because Bill Murray owns a baseball team and is being inducted into the Hall of Fame. This is probably the biggest honor I've ever had. I, I did win a Golden Globe once, and I was nominated for an Oscar, and I've won some other kind of things like that. But this is, they cannot, um, uh, they cannot explain this to me. This is Bill Murray's baseball team. Tell us about your favorite Bill Murray movie. Uh, Zombieland. Stripes. Space Jam by far. Bill Murray is their boss. In one word, describe Bill Murray as a boss. Awesome. Outstanding. Genius, I guess. Unique. Legend. Funny. The baseball boss, uh, I'm a uh, <laughs> good grief. Good shoes, though. Bill Murray's official title, director of fun. First time I ever met him, he just walks in and he said, what's the deal with this lighting in here? And he said, uh, we're going to put some pink gel lighting in here to soften the mood. And then he turned around and walked away. Well, the first time I saw Bill Murray, he uh, peeked his head into our dugout with a set of glasses and with a little chain hanging from him with a little mustache on it, like a real corny mustache. The reaction was like, oh my god, it's Bill Murray, you know? He's a comical legend. It's the first time I got a chance to meet him. What a treat. He uh, picked me up at the airport. <laughs> Tell us about the tarp sliding. Tarp sliding is awesome. It's one of like the greatest tarp slides I've ever seen in my life. I was gonna run out and coach third base for him, but but I I choked. It looked pretty awesome. <laughs> I could have got on ESPN and, and USA Today, but you know, maybe next time. It was pretty pretty impressive. Probably the slowest base runner I've ever seen, but once he hit on plate, unbelievable. I swear he slid about 30 yards. Well, that didn't they didn't they didn't kick me out for that. So, but the slide into home was uh, I don't know, that was really fun. If you ever get a chance to do that on a tarp, I strongly urge you to take it. That was really fun to do. Bill Murray was born a Cubs fan. I will die a Cubs fan. He will always love baseball. When I got into Wrigley Field and I went through the turnstile, just before I hit the stairs that would take me up to the field level, my brother Brian said, Billy, wait. And he covered my eyes and he walked me up the steps. And then he took my hands away. And I saw the most beautiful building I had ever seen in my life. A field of green and a wall of green and a scoreboard of green and fans of all colors. And my heart just leapt and I thought, ah, this is where I'm supposed to be. Uh, what does baseball mean to me? Well, that's a big question, you know. Uh, well, it was uh, where I was first able to put like an enormous amount of energy and enthusiasm as a child. I gave it a lot of attention, and, I, and it, uh, it rewarded me with a, a lot of joy. Before the ball game, I was driving him in a convertible, and he was waving like, you know, like he was the Queen of England with the hand cupped like that. I said, what are you thinking about right now? He said, well, this is reminding me of a scene from the movie Patton, where the general's coming back into town on a parade after winning a big battle at war. And he says, all fame is fleeting. And then he just sort of looked at me and I said, really? He goes, yep. And that was it. <laughs>